He came to me after his death. Abaddon. Alive. And I wanted so much to believe. I was such a fool. Azrael, you saw Abaddon after he fell. Saw him? I brought him here to Eden. What treachery is this, Azrael? Eden doesn't exist. Not anymore. Ignorant sprite. I bore witness as the first ones were cast out and the garden fell to ruin. I could not let heaven's first gift and greatest weapon simply rot or worse, fall to darkness. I hid it away. The tree of knowledge. Then Abaddon has been to the tree. You must draw upon its gifts now. If some way exists to stop the destroyer, the tree will show it to you. I never dared use it myself. Perhaps if I had, things would have been... different. And Abaddon was of his gift. That was not for me to know. Each who comes before the tree receives a different gift. Some receive nothing. Others are driven mad by visions, or simply destroyed. No, I cannot say for certain. Come. so long that it has marked you. Creatures of the light will sense it, as I have. In this place you are worse than a demon. Conquer the shadow, then you may pass. Are you ready to face yourself in the light? Not all are prepared for what they see. The Mask of Shadows. Yes. You will see into the Shadow Realm for as long as you wear the mask. Fight well.
first gift awaits you. I will remain here with the Watcher. I'm not letting the horseman out of my sight. Where he goes, I go. Indeed. Go then, Darkling. Make for the tree. You will never reach the other side. Don't forget who holds the leash.
Would you serve in heaven or rule in hell? The storm is coming, Uriel. Soon, I will need you at my side. I would follow you into hell, my lord. <laughs> the best laid plans, or so the humans used to say. You... did this? You plotted and schemed to call us to this world. I simply took advantage of your initiative. No... I will consider this an offering, Abaddon. And you... My loyal servant, join me, and take up the mantle of the Destroyer. No. Once the throne learns what you've done, you'll be cast down, dragged in chains before the Council. You're already damned. So I offer you this choice. Would you serve in heaven, or rule in hell? Return to Azrael. Persuade him to help us. Then, together, we will change the face of the universe. <laughs> Abaddon must be punished. He bends the law to his will, laughs in the face of the council. What proof do we have? The seals are intact. No doubt the angel had help, but from whom? Until we know, we must wait. His act breeds open defiance. The council weakens. How long before we are overthrown? We cannot stop Abaddon, but there are others who might, if they had reason. We cannot send the ball. Without proof, there is no justice, only murder. They will see no reason in this assassination. We will send one for whom vengeance is reason enough. The blade is scattered. I know the seventh seal. This world is ours. Heaven is ours. <laughs> you had to know it was a one-way ticket. Abaddon is the Destroyer. The Archangel? He was betrayed. He is only a pawn in some greater game. You must bring him peace. Peace? Abaddon is the Destroyer. I'm pretty sure peace is off the table. Did you find any clues among the visions? A way to stop him? There was a sword. One which broke the seals. The Armageddon Blade. But... After the seals were broken, 
Abaddon ordered the blade destroyed on the very anvil of its creation. Horseman, I fear the blade is lost to us now. It will be made again. What else did you see? Abaddon guards the seventh seal. He plots with others to storm the White Gates. Uriel will lead the Hellguard against him and fail. What else did you see? I saw nothing else. I will open a gate to Eternus. Once it is closed, the garden and its secrets will be lost forever. When you are ready, I will begin.